two, Again, thank you, Kekko, for the prime, bro. Yo, yo, yo. It's your boy. I'm gonna be honest. Listen, I love drip. I love uh, we're, we're two seconds in. I love drip, but... Can we get somebody with some fucking enthusiasm to be the goddamn fucking reporter, man? Let somebody else hold the goddamn fucking camera forehead. How about you fucking go and hold the fucking mic, man? Yo, yo, yo. It's your boy for uh, it's your boy future. <laughs> um, a future court tear here. We got the BSK. It sounds like he just woke up, man. Okay. And we got the one and only king himself. O T T. You see him with the crown on. You know what time it is. Stop playing with the boy. Anyway, Did, bro. That's even worse. Why let him hold the mic? O T T has you know something to tell the people, the fans, the people watching at home. You know. Now they're interested in this war with MG versus BSK. So go ahead, King. How's it the anyway? Wait, wait, wait. Do you guys know how the MG war started? You guys know well, what's the context of this? How did the MG war start? This video will explain. Okay, beautiful. Chess. Well, what's you will explain? Thank you. BSK. Also, chat follow right, stream. First off, I'd like to follow, go and, follow, uh, follow. Let everybody know that Sergio already knows this news. I did tell him today. He was pretending as though it didn't bug him, but I know deep down in his soul, he's upset as hell. Now, here it is. About two and a half weeks ago, I got a call from Gabriel, who is the sit-in leader for the Marabuntas. I call him the sit-in leader because he's never been a real leader. Let's be real. Sergio retired, left it to Marco. Marco said, fuck this. I ain't handling all this motherfucking mess. And he dipped. Gabriel ended up taking it. Now, Gabriel used to be Aztecas. For those that don't remember, that turf right there behind us used to be Azteca turf. Mm. Now run and operated by GG themselves. Now, okay. Sergio was fighting BSK months ago, and he knew he was dead. He didn't have numbers. He didn't have money. Okay. All he had was his mouth yapping, yapping. So what did he do? He convinced Gabriel to fold the Aztecas, to merge with the Marabuntas and unite so that he could fight us. And what did he do? He used Gabriel for all of his money, siphoned mm. millions of dollars out of him. Mm -mm -mm. And then when it all finished, what did he do? He retired. He went Tell to the him, airport. Bro. Tell him. He went to the airport and flew off into Liberty City. To hey, listen, you know what I'm saying? I fuck with OTT. He's the king. You smell me? But who the fuck are the people around him? Who the hell is this? Who the hell is that? Who the hell is this? Who the hell is that? Who the hell is this? Who the hell is the guy over there? Why does that matter? What do you mean, why does that matter? I want to know who the fuck is in the background, asshole. What do you mean, why does that matter? Seen again until recently. Why does that matter? What? Now, while he was gone for all these months. Learn in RP. Yeah, man, because I definitely see them in RP. I've, ne I've seen one BSK member in the last year, and it was OTT two days ago in my tsunami. Mother sucker. Gabriel's been Is he gonna allow them to speak? I don't know. They, they were just shouting just now, so I was just, you know. Picking up the pieces. Not being able to use the gang app because Sir. Like bro, yeah, bro, what the hell are you waffling? All I asked was who they were. That's it. All I uh, all I asked was who who they were. You don't know Frankie, bro. I know none of them. I don't know any of them. I only know OTT, and that's not even like a shot at them. <laughs> I don't know who they are. Like, I was just asking. But why does it matter? What do you mean, why does it matter? I'm asking who they are. I'm asking who they are. What do you mean, why does it I'm just asking. I want to know who the players are. Man, 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 I can't ask who the hell they are now. Jesus Christ. What up, Space? The leader on. Why are you yelling? Bro, 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 bro. Fuck you guys. I just watch the fucking video and shut the hell up. Being able to get any of the Marabuntas that were original Marabuntas to follow his orders because in reality, 
it was Aztecas really leading the Marabuntas while there was only a couple of them there. Now, why am I giving you this backstory, you ask? Well, two and a half weeks ago, Gabriel gave me a call and said, OT, I need to speak to you in private. Fuck you, Avic. Nobody can hear us. Mm. Nobody can come here. You can't share this with anybody. I said, okay. Left to right, crack, Kenji, Red, Max, Wes, Frankie, Fibbler, and V. Okay. Thank you. Now, throughout these months, while Sergio's been gone, Gabriel has been getting off with the BSK. I, I literally said hi to her, and she didn't even say anything, so. Allegedly banks together. Damn, allegedly some robberies together. Also, we do just have a new video out. Because it's just my, uh... By himself wait, what? With wait, there's another video out? You never say hi to me? I literally just did, but you're deaf. Now do we ask that Tony gets canceled, Zerk on the state of RP, and more? Wait. Wait, what the hell? There's another video out? God damn. Oh, shit. Yo, Chad. There's another. Hey. Hey. Yo. Oh, yo. Shit. Yo, Chad. Yo, go check out the fucking videos, bruh. Yo, turbulent going crazy. Wait, what is this one? Dean, Dean Nadi reacts to Dean on getting him invited to the Mandem IRL meetup. Ah, oh, bro. I didn't know about this one. <laughs> I didn't know about this one, but that's okay. Nadi reacts to XCC, Violet Shell, BSK, Shoot, Denzel's car, and more. Schedule? Okay, good shit. Fog. Anyway, sorry, sorry. I keep pausing the video. Sorry. It's a couple of Aztecas and maybe a straggler marabunta from time to time and he said ot i got an offer you should do more youtube you. streams they're chill as shit you were right about sergio that was fun right he that used, youtube stream was good he used all of us and then he got up and left because he's a coward he didn't want to face the rain he fucked off into the Did anyone say why sergio came bag, back and the bag ain't worth shit you were right ot mm -hmm. you were right and I said, yeah, I know I was right, but, but what, what does this have to do with anything? He said, well, I'm about to offer you something that I'm never going to offer to anybody else, ever. And even if you decide you don't want to do this, came back just to, just to come back. Because if this gets out, Hydra and other groups are going to come. Mm. Now, what is this, you ask? Well, this was the plan. Gabriel, As who is the holiday. leader of the Marabuntas told me that he is willing to give BSK every single spray that the Marabuntas have. Mm. Oh, shit. All of them. No pixels so of holiday. So that we can expand our no territory and no become way. the biggest gang in the city. He said he loved the fact that we've been the underdogs and we've been sitting through... Okay, listen. Wait, what? I just subscribed. Thank you, Lay. Wait, he said BSK being the biggest gang in the city. Okay. Listen, NBC is like I left, right? And NBC is pretty dead right now. And even if they took MG sprays, NBC would still have more sprays. I really don't think sprays make you the biggest gang in the city at this moment in time at all. Motherfuckers have 54 sprays. That shit is useless, man. He said in the South Side. I mean, even so. He said. Even so, NBC being dead still has more sprays. The door. And then doesn't uh sprays are literally just useless. They're 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 pretty fucking useless. Frankie is the famous uh, is the famous is oh fuck it, I'm gonna just keep coming in and out then. What is this? Here we go. Ready? Three. Oh, you're saying she's famous because she was the girl who said, Fuck it, I'm gonna keep going in and out. Two, one, go. I'm just gonna keep going in and out. Fuck it. You have shame to have one. Jamal! He's inside. We walked into it. We walked I'm into it. I don't see him. I'm just gonna keep coming back in and out. Fuck it. <laughs> I don't see him. I'm just gonna keep coming back in and out. Fuck it. I'm just gonna keep going, coming back in and out. Fuck it. Jamal! 
I back in a nook. <laughs> I'm just gonna keep coming back in a nook. Fuck it. Fuck it. Fuck it. I'm just gonna keep coming back in a nook. Fuck it. I'm just gonna keep coming in and out. Uh, not in and out. In and out. Fuck it. That's so funny. That's a lot. Uh, that's actually hilarious. She didn't do. Oh, I know she didn't do it, but that shit's fucking hilarious. That is actually fucking so funny. I remember that shit too. That that whole Jamal shit that he did with BSK was so good. Love the fact that we've been the underdogs and we've been. I know it didn't get fucking bro. It didn't get donor walled, bro. Crippled, but you know what I'm saying? Like, she doesn't want mod, bro. She's all. chilling. So every season, the ups, the downs, the lows, and the king is still here. But it gets better. Also, chat, Subathon on Saturday, by the way. Within the Fuck me. And there were four BSK people on top for real. Within there. And I won't say their names because I want Sergio to figure what out what pixelated ah pixelated clips huh pixelated clips uh you gonna post a reaction to the channel as well huh asshole pixelated clips huh? I heard you were Zay huh are you Zay pixelated Huh? Mother sucker? I haven't posted shit from your channel in like three months. Bro, fuck you, GGC looking ass motherfucker. All you post is fucking GG. I don't want to fucking hear, asshole. That were willing to drop the Marabunta flag and become BSK the next motherfucking day. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Gabriel and Blake, who are both, I guess, higher ups. You got a clip channel, I ain't trying to step on toes. Wanted to stay Man, you know what? Kiss me, bro. Good shit, bro. You can still post clips in the algorithm. Uh, listen, we're, we're, yeah, we're posting. I, I, we're on top of it now. We're good. Way too much fun on the screen. The thing is, with LGT's big talk. Oh, uh, wait, wait. Talk's big, but also knows his place. He's smart. He's learned his lesson when he tries to test GG. So now he's always on the side with everything. Bro was posting only CG before that. Yeah, he doesn't even post me, bro. That's like, it's fucked up, you know? You can post shit that's not on my channel, you know? <laughs> Actually, whatever, I don't give a fuck. Who cares? Uh, BSK with MG sprays would have been 60 sprays. How many sprays does MG have? Well, for some time, with the possibility of them joining other Marabuntas to come into BSK. Now, his plan was this. Well, we just can get can't a go ahead and give you all the sprays mm. because... There's going to be a couple of Sergio uh, disciples. Kid 34? Yeah, but how many does MG have? Is this OTT? Yeah. When he starts to see how does MG have 24 sprays? So we formulated a plan where we were at 34 sprays and we wanted to get to 36. Put your fucking phone on silent. Mm. Oh, oh, shit. Oh, shit. 36. Put your fucking phone on silent. Mm. Nah, sprays don't matter. <laughs> They haven't mattered for a while. 36. So what they wanted to do is give us two sprays in shambles, which is right on the border between BSK and El Burro, the ones that we were fighting over a long time ago. And what Gabriel was going to do is he was going to tell the Marabuntas that weren't in on this that we had just worked out a deal for two sprays to get us to 36, and we were going to pay for them, and it was all well, and who gives a fuck? Wouldn't have been any red flags. But once those two went up, and we started taking more. That's when the shit show would have would have ensued. Apparently, he said some crazy so shit in this, right? The idea that after we get those two, we take Sergio spray on his house next. Mm. Once we have that, we've got core fudge. Then we can defend in that area with as much as we want, and hold any stragglers and kill and exterminate the rest of the Sergio disciples. And then we take all the rest of the sprays within the area, making this is considered meta, even though it's like news. Uh, I personally believe that this is being recorded as news, so it should be used as news. So it's not meta. Whatever is being said in here is is. If you watch this video, you can use this information. Fudge, upper fudge, oils, El Burro. All of it BSK. Yeah, anyone can watch and it, yeah. they wanted to join 
BSK oh, nah. to lead the charge. Wait, what? What? El Burrow, all of it BSK. And they wanted to join BSK oh, nah. to lead the charge to extinct the Marabuntas behind Sergio and the rest of them's back. <gasps> now, <gasps> Sergio had no idea about any of this shit. Wait, what? Wait, okay. and what am I missing? Wait, what? Apparently one of the BSK shot callers left because they have an ex-cop as a hang around. Or had I stated before that these interviews are live and are yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, it's definitely not meta. They see all those techers wanted to fold and become BSK and destroy MG. I see. Is the Clash ad yours on the video? No, nah, no, nah. I don't have, I don't have a Clash ad. I only have CS:GO Roll. If it would have, but I don't have to put anything anywhere. I just gamble. So Gabe had the idea that after we get those two. We take Sergio spray on his house next. Mm. Once we have that, we've got core fudge. Then we can defend in that area with as much as we want and hold any stragglers and kill and exterminate the rest of the Sergio <laughs> disciples. Nice one, each year, okay. And then we take all the rest of the sprays within the <laughs> area, making fudge, upper fudge, what oils, moon, hope you're well. what's up, what's up? El Burro, all of it BSK. And they wanted to join BSK oh, nah. to lead the charge to extinct the Marabuntas behind Sergio and the rest of them's back. <gasps> now, <gasps> Sergio had no idea about any of this shit. Okay? And it was so secretive. I see. Okay, that people now remember. People I see. Behind me have What's going no on? I was just reacting to stuff, but I'm not here. even in play, that this was going to happen. Well, four or five days later, Did you play Sergio Alice Charles appears will be fire? from vacation. All right? He's back, and I see him a couple of times. I'm like, yo, Sergio, what's going on? He's like, ah, I'm just on a holiday. <laughs> <laughs> and then all of a sudden, I see more Marabuntas popping up. So I call up Gabriel, and I ask Gabe, what's going on, man? In private, of course. And he says, yo, there's a civil war what's about the, to happen. What's the calling viewers about RP? Uh, I'm basically gonna sorry. We'll keep pausing. I'm basically gonna click on somebody's name and We're gonna add guest and I'm gonna whoever whoever's interested and has a camera um, And a working microphone. We're gonna add them as a guest and we're gonna put them in the call We're gonna talk about RP and no pixel and yeah drama and yeah It's gonna be as techers versus the marabuntas. It's all going down that's when I had a plan. This is about to be because cringe. Oh, it's about to be fuck. Wait, this is about to be cringe or the, the calls? Because, well, we'll see. This is the first time trying this. I don't know when we're going to do it. We'll, we'll do it in a few after we're reacting. We'll, we'll see. We'll see. The calls are definitely going to be cringe, but it's okay. It's okay. It, it's all right. I didn't want to listen. I didn't want to do it in Discord because if I do it in Discord and somebody like pulls out their penis or says something crazy, uh, then I'm liable. Um, but if I do it on guest star and they pull out their penis or show their titties or say something, uh, that's on them and they get perm banned from Twitch. So, want it out. He's Not many people who do face cam. Uh, we'll see. We'll see. We'll ask in a few. Oh, Marabuntas, he doesn't want to lead. He can't stand the dudes. He hates Sergio and everything that he's done to him and the rest of them. So, what did I do? If, One if, of the if there's a not a lot of, uh, I'm rewinding because we missed a bit. Um, if there's not a lot of people that are willing to put cam on, uh, then we, we you don't have to have it on. But I want to have it on just so I'm not talking to fucking blank screens, you know? Because I thought Gabriel wanted out. He's been complaining about Marabuntas. He doesn't want to lead. He can't stand the dudes. He hates Sergio and everything that he's done to him and the rest of them. So what did I do? Talk to the chat box. It's the same. Comes down to the car yes. wash. But I want to see and the viewers, I know you know? This Marabunta is close to Sergio. So I take him aside and I start planting seeds. Yo, how do you feel about Sergio retiring and then all of a sudden coming back? Like, you know, how does that make you feel? Because I think that's some rat shit. I don't think you should be able to retire. You know who started that bullshit? Summer. Summer started that bullshit. If you oh, a gang leader what up, and Nassai? you leaving a gang, you need to be blooded the fuck out, killed, and that's that. Well, <laughs> okay. <laughs> Hey, hey, I don't agree about that one, buddy. Yeah, I don't agree with 
You need to be blooded out and killed. Okay, blooded out, sure. Actually, no, bitch. Not even blooded out, mother sucker. I don't, you guys say I agree, right? Okay, let me say this. Let me say this to you, right? You guys say I agree. Yeah, I agree. Okay. So, if any of these gang leaders leave their gang, yeah, they're going to leave their RP arcs. They're going to leave uh, their businesses they worked years to get. They're going to leave their compounds. They're going to leave their money, their cars, their uh, clothes that they paid IRL money for. Uh, they're going to leave. Uh, yeah, so, and first of all, talking about you need to be blooded out. No, I wasn't blooded into my own gang, bitch. I created the fucking gang. So if I want to sit there and leave after three fucking years, mind you, NBC was one of the longest running gangs behind the current gangs that are still around. Was there before Seaside, was there before Rust, was there before Mandem, was there before GG, was there before... 90% of these fucking gangs, okay? I founded this gang. I didn't join or or create a already made gang and 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 you know what I'm saying? This is my gang that I founded, you know what I'm saying? If I want to pick them up and throw them in the fucking dumpster, I can do that. You get what I'm saying? It's a little different um than what people want to say right now because you're not going to throw away the clothes you paid IRL money for, the cars that you you uh, got liveries for, your businesses that you worked years for, your compound. You're not going to. No one's going to do that, bro. Everyone can talk a big game and talk about you should die uh, if you leave your. No, no. Maybe if you're a member, sure. But if you're a leader, like, I don't believe that's true. I, I don't. I, I don't. I don't believe that, bro. But I understand. I understand the city is changing. I have no idea what this drama is. It's not drama by NBC. Just people think that uh, I should perma because I left NBC as the leader. But I don't believe that as being uh, viable. That's, that's very dumb. Changed? Because realistically I speaking, if any of these uh, people um, uh, who are leaders leave their gang, they won't perma. And I can promise you that unless 3.0 is ending in a week and 4.0 is coming out or whatever, none of these people were perm. None of these people were perm. Zero people. You saying that as if Speedy would perma. Speedy did the exact same shit as me. What do you mean what? What do you mean what? Obsidian takes. Nah, I feel like Obsidian is somebody I should get on a fucking call because he seems like he's a brain dead bastard. Tell me. Go ahead, huh? Go ahead. Speak. Speak, asshole. Speak. All right, anyways. Speedy ain't fucking perma. Um, when he did that, I didn't perma. Um, you know what I'm saying? Uh, no, like none of these li ODT wouldn't die and, uh, oh, oh, nah. Hold the fucking phone, bitch. We talking about dying if you're the leader of the gang and leave. ODT was part of the misfits that he founded and created and then didn't fucking die. Dundee left and didn't fucking die. Speedy left and didn't fucking die. Fucking, uh, I don't want to fuck. Hey, ODT, hey, this motherfucker ODT was part of the ballers, but he wasn't leader, but he was leader of the goddamn misfits and didn't fucking die. Nah, I don't want to. Dundee? Nah, Dundee didn't fucking die. He got blooded out, but he ain't die. All these motherfuckers ain't die. All these vir virtue signaling fucking bums. Okay? None of these leaders die, but all everybody wants to fucking talk about. Oh, you should die. Ain't none of these bum ass fucking people dying, man. I don't want to fucking hear it. Ain't nobody going to die if they leave. I ever see a leader being able to leave a gang is if the gang folds completely. And it's over. Then everybody can go their own separate ways and whatnot. But what did Sergio do? He fucking dipped when shit got tough. And you know what the king did? The king sat here mm. and grew with all of my people. The new balls leader John didn't die. All of the seaside ball. That's what I'm saying. None of these people. No one's telling me to perma. I'm just saying that the people who say I agree. No, I didn't miss it. I, I heard what he said. But I, the people who are saying I agree that you should perma. That's very wait wait what was the text? If so what not? I can't understand mm. that bullshit. Because see, it's your him and the rest of them.
So what did I do? Marabunta is close to Sergio. So I take him back. Like, you know, how does that make you feel? What's the reason because for leaving NBC? Rat shit. Yeah, I see. I don't put think it. You should be able to retire. You know who started that bullshit? Summer. Dang. You need to be blooded the fuck out, killed, and that's that. Mm. But I, un mm. but I understand. Mm. I understand mm. the city has changed. The only way I ever see a leader being able to leave a gang is if the gang folds completely and it's over. Then everybody can go their own separate ways and whatnot. But what did Sergio do? He fucking dipped when shit got tough. And you know what the king did? The king sat here. Mm. Where's the fucking text? With all of my people. At Guy Jones, I don't want to hear this guy Marty anymore, bro. This guy Marty is literally the number one guy, okay, that will never, ever do this. This guy will never perma. He is literally immune to permaing. Why is he on my... You are best friends with the guy who left the Vagos, and the Vagos are a pre-made GTA gang, and he didn't die. So I don't want to fucking hear it, okay? You are best friends with the goddamn ex-leader of the fucking Vagos, okay? Don't fucking... Hey, do not put me in this, okay? Okay, you understand me? Like when people say, "Can I give my VIP to somebody else for mod instead?" Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But I have to find somebody to uh, give the VIP to, and then we'll we'll swap it tomorrow. I got you. Um, he didn't leave the Vagos. Leave the night. He did leave the Vagos. He left them. Okay, and I I, I want to say this because people in game say these things tomorrow. Yeah, because I have to find someone to give the VIP to. Game. How was I scammed? I'm just trading her fucking VIP for a fucking mod, asshole, just for free. Like, here you go. I'm doing it tomorrow, asshole. Anyways, listen, listen, listen. It's so difficult to talk about free. Yeah, yeah, I'm saying it's fucking free, asshole. But I'm also saying that I'm not going to do it right now. I got to figure out who gets the VIP. Anyways, the people in game... Oh, bro, like, look at this. Look at this. Why? Why? Like, did I say that? Did I say that? It's a free slot, bro. I have to figure out who I'm giving it to before I mod. Oh, my God, bro. Like, shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Anyways, the people in game, the people in game, I can't tell them in game that, oh, you know, like, the reason I left NBC is because you know, oh, see this, this, like, I can't tell them I left NBC because I wasn't getting, like, I say in game that I wasn't getting anything, but I say, like, business, this, that, but in reality, bro, like, like, there was nothing left for the character there, bro, like, oh, see, there's nothing left for Guy Jones in NBC, like, NBC was a gang double the amount of time all of these gangs were gangs, bro. Like, double the amount GG, double the amount Seaside, double the amount fucking uh, Rust. Like, literally double the time that these gangs were gangs. You get what I'm saying? Double. Three years and half these gangs are a year and a half, maybe two years coming, approaching. Okay? So, when that's the case, like, I want to see where these people are in, th in a year and a half from now, two years from now. Because... God knows that 90% of these guys will be fucking gone as their gangs in that many years. Russ probably won't be a thing. Seaside maybe depends, but like a lot, like it's, it's what happens, bro. Fade in and out. That's, that's basically it. And we made our run and built our legacy, this, that, and the third. And I, it was time for guy to fucking step, step down. He didn't get literally anything, no business, no construction, no, literally zero, zero in three years. And people complain about waiting for stuff for five months, six months. It's been three years, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, come on, bro. During the tough times, the good times, the bad times, this is the way the it be, bro. Times, we're right. still here doing it. Damn and right. Sergio reappears. Yes, so I plant the seeds, knowing that this motherfucker was going to go back to Sergio and tell Sergio that I'm talking shit because I wanted Sergio to lose his cool, 
come down to Brogue, do some dumb shit so we can start fighting with them. So when we start fighting with them, I assumed at that point, Gabriel wasn't going to back Sergio, was going to say, fuck you, fuck this gang. I'm not funding all this again. You're in this on your own. You left me here. Of course, for I'm in everybody's fucking mind and character, man. It's and so I'm annoying, dude. I'm not about dude. to pick up your bullshit. But that's not what happened. No, 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 no. Once we started fighting and Sergio took the bait, Gabriel gives me a call the next morning and asks me what's going on. Finish the whole plate of pasta and, and you like, ain't finished the video? I've started it. This is your chance. This is what you wanted, right? And he says, no, I, 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 I'm blue. I'm, I'm Marabunta. And I'm going, what? I'm dumbfounded. Because this guy wanted to Who's Sergio, the old MG thing. leader? And it was, it was being in the process. This shit was going down. I'm going to say there was more hype and buzz around MG getting a flag than NBC ever getting anything, which is so unfair to you. I mean, yeah, it was... Um, I mean, it took them a really long time to get a flag. Granted, they deserved it. But at the end of the day... Um, like I said, we were a staple for three fucking years, bro. I eventually, you know, after three years, not everybody's coming around this, that, and the third. But, I mean, bro, a 50%, 90%, whatever, 50%, 60%, 70% of the time, there's not a lot of GG around. 50%, 60% of the time, there's not a lot of uh, these guys around, these guys around. Like, people come around when there's specific stuff to do, right? There's not many seaside around all the time. There's not like there's there's only set specific gangs that are around a lot recently. And it's because they're gangs who are fresh and new, who are still recruiting fucking random ass members or whatever the case may be, and doing things that such as NBC that they haven't done. Okay. Um, I got you, Yak. Um but you get what I'm saying? Like, I don't know, bro. Not man them? Okay, you don't need to write in all caps, my brother, but um yes, man them. Um because let's be no no, you're good, Julian, but let's be real here. Um they they don't um they don't um come around unless they're all around. Um Right, so they'll go play like Valorant for eight hours and and do this, that, and they, they have a lot of stuff, right? Um, right, they got the mural, they got the compound, they got uh the businesses with millions, they got this, that, right? Um so it's more so that when they do come around, they come around all together, not having like this person comes around and then this person's on this time zone. It's more like a business than a uh then like i don't know how to explain it they're more they're more um like business oriented they're all straight every single one of them stream i also believe chat that nbc's downfall after three years um was that nobody nobody was a streamer uh i was literally the only streamer in nbc uh for years for years, years, years. I was every single other person was just, they were our peers, bro. They RP, that's it. So, you know, the only like POVs you would basically get would would be me or, or you know, like I was the only, I was the only streamer. I mean, you don't have, uh, want to do the same thing every day for years. Exactly. That guy with John Paul here on the right is a copper X cop just fired. Oh shit. I think them having Zerk helped a lot. Yeah, but it's not just man them, though. It's, it's more than that. Like, Seaside, uh, having Benji, and Benji's close to Toby. Uh, um, you know what I'm saying? Like, bro, I, we like when I say we got nothing, chat, NBC didn't make enough noise on the server. God was the only one I really saw. Yeah, but it's not noise on the server. It's NBC didn't make enough noise on Twitch. Okay. Um... If you guys recall, I mean, a lot of you guys are new RP viewers, okay? So, the first year and a half to two years of NBC, we literally warred every single gang because they started beef with us. We wore GSF like three times. We smoked them. We wore Ballas. We smoked them. We wore Vagos. We smoked them. And that was Benji and Speedy Vagos. We wore 
um a bunch of random fucking gangs we smoked them like we we literally fought everybody so we made enough noise in the server uh we had crazy rpers moody aleem salim uh peanut me all pilbis uh, like we had great rpers as well we, we jack was part of us at the time as well so it wasn't that we didn't make enough noise we just didn't have streams like we didn't have streamers bro Sit simple as we had people we had people you know around every single day at the same time every single day and just on every day we lit like it was that like that for two years uh sad truth viewers equals prio and getting shit yeah i mean now that you mentioned i don't remember anyone from xp except from cookie and jack yeah jack wasn't in nbc but he he was with with us till uh, gg became a thing because they weren't a thing before us i mean gg honestly got the comp out and all that but in terms of things that they got in omi did he want that yeah but but even like oh they got the compound the the business whatever 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 it is um every every group besides like ballas and vagos got more stuff than nbc ever did and the reason balls and vagos and ball vagos was had a lot of shit when speedy was there the problem with those guys is that ballers rotate leaders like his fucking candy and Vagos do now as well, right? Um, so it's hard to give anything to these guys when they rotate leaders like it's fucking chocolate, okay? Vagos had a meth lab and a bench, but Speedy was gone and now they don't got nothing. Now they, you know, uh, you don't even know who's in Vagos. You don't even know like ballers rotate leaders, this, that, and the third, right? But when Speedy left, it was gone. Speedy had those things. So when you are a set gang with the same leader for three years that was established on its own from the ground up, created before 90% of these groups and you get nothing, you realize like, okay, like maybe it's time to move on, you know? So that's where I'm going with this. I'm sorry I rambled for a while, but this is my piece. You get what I'm saying? This is what it is. It's a factual statement. We got nothing the entire three years for being a gang that had the same leader for years and years and years with the same people. And that's it. NBC, I got a boat that was ready in the server. We didn't even get the boat. All we got was we have the house here. That's it. We got motherfucker. You could ask a realtor. Can you make this purchasable? Yes, they make it like, you know what I'm saying? Like it was, we didn't even get that. We got chains. Yeah, but we deserve the fucking chains. You know what I'm saying? Come on. We deserve those fucking chains. Oh, that's not even getting something at the, uh, that stage. It was because we were we were a gang that existed so long before that when all these chains came out, you know, we were the gang. We we're the next up gang to get it. If Benji was leader of Vagos would be a big gang in my opinion. Speedy messed up and practically killed his gang. I mean, yeah, but he doesn't care about it. Aren't they taking away the boat now? Who's taking the boat? But yeah, that's that's my piece. That's my piece. Also, follow the stream chat. Thank you. Okay. And then all of a sudden, all fuck of a sudden, you, Andrew. Fuck now you. Now that Sergio's here, he wants to go. Yeah, exactly. Anyone can get a chain. Literally. Again. They just because need to get Gabriel it made. It takes a while. It took us a long time bitch. to get ours. He's the biggest. Mm. Oh my. Oh my. Oh shit. He wants to go and fight with the Marabuntas again, because Gabriel is a beta bitch he's the biggest mm. beta bitch that the city has ever oh, seen oh shit what has happened to nbc by the way uh it's being run by pilbis i don't know what he's doing with it but guy jones has been tormenting them a little bit put marcus in the icu it was on my youtube stream um but put marcus in the icu uh and just been doing a crazy arc with uh terrorizing nbc like the boat house at the dock i thought i read it on Reddit somewhere is getting removed uh, my misread it. What? Oh, sh I don't even he know about that. He doesn't have a backbone. I don't know what Sergio has on this motherfucker. I couldn't tell you, but he has got to. Why is he going at Gabriel like this? God damn, because he didn't merge with BSK. In the middle of bum fuck nowhere, with a gun to their head and a C4 strapped to their chair, for this guy to go back on all damn. the shit that he said. So here we are. Now fighting the Marabuntas, and Sergio knows. 
And I know Sergio didn't know about this before because this was the biggest secret that we've ever seen. And the Marabuntas were scared because Hydra was out looking for a new home. And they didn't want to leak the fact that they were willing to give up all of the territory to BSK because they were scared Hydra or any other of these up-and-coming groups that are actually around and actually doing stuff and actually deserve turf was going to go for it before we took it. Is them right? Yep. God. They're ah. a bunch of pussies. Gabriel, this is going to end one way for you, motherfucker. Either oh. I'm going to kill you or Sergio's going to end up killing you. Oh, that motherfucker shit. might use you right now. He might use you again for the for the next three months, six months, but Sergio is going to retire again, or he's at the end of this That's war, like he he's going to be in a fucking casket. Because I don't the know if Kings not. ain't fucking around. And yeah, <clears throat> this is big news, but it ain't all that big news because nobody actually gives a flying fuck about the Marabuntas. Whether they exist or don't exist, it doesn't matter. It doesn't affect the city. It doesn't affect the, uh, the south side. Sergio's on here on holiday. <laughs> he ain't here because he wants to be here. But that's okay. Oh, shit. I'm going to send him back to wherever the fuck he came from. You hear me, Sergio? You hear me? Ah, damn. Who's and that guy BSK? Gabriel might not be able to snake all of your fucking territory from you now that you're back and you control the app. But the king's going to take it anyway. The king's going to take mm. everything from you. Or had paid two free deagles for this interview. Wait, he gave them two free deagles for this interview? Guns ain't what they used to be, Sergio. They ain't $5,000 a browning anymore, bitch. What? Why did he pay them for a fucking interview? How much money do you really have? How many bullets can you really take? Oh, yeah. I mean, OTT did get charged a million, but he paid for that, right? Because the Kings ain't gonna stop. Until there ain't no more blue for the RP, yeah. But like, why get charged? You know what I'm saying? Like, I know he like. I don't know if he offered to pay, but like, why would they charge him? Uh, do you understand? I know it's for the RP, but why? Why would they charge him? What? Like, why would they charge forehead for it? And me. Mm. Right. Now, service announcement to Sergio: If you don't want to kill everything that you quote unquote love and what you believe in the cockroaches then what i want you to do the problem with the, uh, i'll, I'll say my take it for the effort uh, for the end take off your blue flag and beg the king for forgiveness and go back to the airport where you <laughs> came from you retired <laughs> pussy bitch <laughs> Ooh. That was our. That was fantastic. Cut right there. Cut right there. Cut right there. Cut. Cut. That was fantastic. That was fantastic. It's been cut. It's been cut. It's been cut. It's been cut. Okay. 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 All right. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, you had pyrotechnics fucking playing. No. You know OTT. Hell yeah. You know OTT. That is. That is the best interview. That is the best interview that Hood News has ever received. I believe. Oh hell yeah. Well, I appreciate that, man. I appreciate that. Thank you for giving me the opportunity to just lay it out there. That was good. I ain't gonna lie. For a few weeks now. That is uh, the best that was a good interview we've received. Thank you very much, OTT. Um, we'll get it ready and published, okay? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I appreciate that. You just uh, it's a villain character, a literally, oh, oh, literally. Yeah, the, uh, the yeah. price on the product, and then we gonna make it uh, happen. I'll let you know. I'll let you know. All right. Appreciate you guys. Right. Appreciate good you good, you good luck. Good luck. That was fantastic. <sighs> that was worth every penny, bro. No. In my opinion. That was awesome. That was. How much did you? Wait, you I, pay, you paid for this I paid 120k for this interview. I think it was worth it though. Oh, 100%. Oh, I can't believe that's fucking true though. No, that's that crazy. Is cr the fact that, okay, you know what's crazy? The fact that they're fighting together when one guy was about to sell out the whole gang and they're still fighting together. Okay, listen, listen, listen. What I was gonna say was, I don't think BSK is really gonna get anything. You know why? Because <laughs> Sergio's gonna go back on vacation. Okay, who's gonna give the sprays? <laughs> who's gonna give the fucking sprays? Who isn't Sergio the leader on the app? They're not gonna get anything. Sergio's gonna go back on vacation in a day or two, two days, three days. 
They won't have six active members around and they won't get the sprays. Even even if they do have six active members, unless unless um like they just take it while all the members are around. What up, Jiski? How you doing? Sound familiar? It does sound fucking familiar. Tried to take their fucking sprays and couldn't take it because they're sorry anyway.